Hello, and welcome to another edition of Office Systems Tech Tips. Today I'm going to show you how to load paper on a what we call the tandem tray. It's also called the large capacity tray. As you can notice on this machine here, instead of the traditional four trays, it only has three. But this bottom one here is quite a bit bigger. It holds, uh, I believe, 2,000 sheets. So in a traditional tray, you pull that out. Put your paper in like that and close it up and you're ready to go. On the tandem tray is a little bit different. Oops. On the tandem tray, you're always supposed to load the left side like that and then close up the right side and close that. What happens, you'll hear a little bit of a whirring noise. You can also watch it here on the screen as it goes through here. We're looking right here. And now it's moved that paper over to the correct size. So if you notice when you pull that back out, the paper's magically vanished. It really hasn't. It's on this side. And the reason you do that is because the paper needs to be in there in a specific way or it'll cause the machine to jam. You have some gates here that need to move freely. And by loading it the correct uh, way, it, it cuts down on um, what we call 503 codes. Um, so if you have any questions, if you see that 503 code, you can reference this video on how to fix it. All you have to do is take all the paper out, turn the machine off, turn the machine back on, and then load the paper correctly and it should take care of it. If it doesn't, you can always give us a call and we're happy to take a look. Thank you for joining us today. If you'd like to see more tech tips, please visit our YouTube channel or visit us at officesystemstx.com.